Hello guys, I've been asked several times how I keep my boots immaculate and how I clean them. Well, these white ones, as you can see, they're a couple of years old I think now, and I've been wearing them quite intensively lately. When you look at the soles, you can see they're quite dark. They've got a lot of dirt on them. And what I basically use for cleaning is a gentle hand soap, hand detergent, like you'd all have at home and I use a nail brush, an old nail brush to scrub the soles. I don't use that on the boots themselves just for the soles. So I'm going to get the warm water running now and show you what I do. Make sure the water is not too hot Sort of like lukewarm. The first thing I'll do is with my hands just wash down the boot itself. And if you've got stains you can put some detergent on your hand and just rub it gently on the boot. And then make sure to wash it all off properly again. Now we get to the sole. As you can see that's quite badly stained, so I'll make it wet. i make sure the brush is wet. And I'll put detergent on the brush. Now I start rubbing the sole. As you can see that's already made a big difference, so I'll just repeat that again with some fresh soap. Of course, it's advisable to move the brush with the thread of the sole from left to right. That way you get all the dirt out of the grooves. Now, of course, you won't get them as white as the day they left the factory. If you remember where we came from, I hope you can tell the difference. If I were to repeat that again, you'd even get it whiter than what it is now. But I'll leave it at this for now because I'm quite satisfied with the result of this one. So I'll just get the other boot, let it soak in. And repeat the whole process, just run some water over the top part of the boot to take off any dust or dirt speckles. Don't put soap on my brush, my hand nail brush, and start rubbing. Now make sure you don't use any aggressive uh, soaps or detergents, it's got to be a mild hand soap just based on the old-fashioned soap. Anything that's chemical will definitely damage the rubber or stain it. 
and it's irreversible so once the damage is done you won't get it right again. There you go, as good as new. So that's my secret. Hope this has been of some help to you and good luck polishing, cleaning. See you then, bye.